How do you photograph a ghost? Capturing 3. I Atlas isn't like shooting an ordinary comet. It moves far too fast and shines too faintly for any normal exposure. By the time a telescope gathers even a few seconds of light, the object has already traveled thousands of kilometers. A single snapshot would show nothing but a faint comet-shaped guess. To overcome this, astronomers had to chase it. Advanced tracking software predicted the comet's path second by second, adjusting the telescope's mount in near real time. This technique forces the background stars to blur into long trails, but it holds 3i Atlas in a fixed position on the sensor. The still soft blur you see in the final image is not a lack of focus. It's the visual record of motion being perfectly cancelled out, a precise balance struck between the comet's incredible speed and the telescope's relentless pursuit. Even for veterans like astronomer Robert Warrick, who first spotted Oumuamua, an object at magnitude 17 moving this fast is an extreme challenge. The team had to stack over 60 individual 300-second exposures just to get a coherent signal. This is less like photography, and more like assembling a ghost from whispers of light.